N4H 1890 Extension believes in the power of young people. 1890 Extension sees that every child has valuable strengths and real influence to improve the world around us. Thus, for Black History Month, the Charleston cluster of 1890 Extension 4-H Youth Development partnered with Simmons Pickney Middle School for a 4-H field experience that focused on African American history with a Sights and Insights tour of Charleston, South Carolina. The Sights and Insights Black History Tour is something that we do for all of our 4-H participants in the month of February to celebrate Black History Month. The tour takes the 4-H participants on a tour of Charleston, South Carolina, covering downtown Charleston as well as some parts of James Island, South Carolina. This tour is always something that we like to do with the students because it teaches them about the rich history in Charleston and also gives them exposure to something besides what we do in the class. 4-H serves as America's largest youth development organization empowering nearly six million young people across the U.S. with the skills to lead for a lifetime. The Charleston Cluster 4-H field experience allowed eighth grade students enrolled in Simmons Pickney Middle School 4-H program to explore Charleston's African American history and Gullah Geechee culture with sights and insights. What we're gonna do is my Black History Gullah Geechee Poor Again Best Tour, okay? So we may be able to cover a little bit of James Island, all right? So we're gonna talk about the Gullah Geechee culture, the Poor Again Best, and a lot of them, the black history here that's in Charleston. Al Miller, owner of Sights and Insights Tour, brings over 30 years of experience as a tour guide, and he is very involved in the city's black art and music community scenes. During the tour, Al seamlessly blended authentic cultural expression with the retelling of events that shape the modern day city. Now, this is what is left of McLeod Plantation. So look to the right now. James Allen had 22 plantations. If we lived back then, more than likely, we would have come here by boat. The tour featured several historical landmarks. The 1890 Extension Charleston Cluster 4-H Field Experience exposed students to the Old James Island Plantation and McLeod Plantation, Charleston Old City Jail, the historical aspect of Porgy and Bess, slave quarters on James Island, and students visited graves in which African Americans were buried. Uh, today on our tour, when we were riding, traveling to James Island, we learned about the history of our African American ancestors and like how they lived and like about their culture. And downtown we saw a lot of interesting features on the market. 1890 Extension's Charleston's 4-H Youth Development Programs Reach and Death are unmatched. 4-H reaches kids in several parishes in Charleston County, from urban neighborhoods to suburban schoolyards and local government agencies. During the tour, the 4-H students were exposed to the east side of Charleston, Old Marine Hospital, and the Charleston City Market. What I learned on the tour today was more about Charleston, where I grew up and stuff, like the rainbow houses and what the houses meant to people, and the restaurants that I used to go to when I was little and what they actually meant. As you can see, the 1890 extension, Charleston Cluster 4-H Field Experience, really provided the 4-H students with an exceptional educational opportunity. Um, so the tour was very beneficial for my class. I teach South Carolina history and that um, the students kind of got to see some places we've talked about. Um, Denmark, VC plot we just covered and we are about to hit the Civil War. So we learned a lot of um, great things today on the tour. 1890 Extension aims to bring vital, practical information to agricultural producers, small business owners, consumers, families, and young people. South Carolina State University, an 1890 research and extension, transforming lives and inspiring greatness. For additional information about the 1890 extension programs, please contact Delbert T. Foster, Executive Director of 1890 Programs at 803-536-8460. Or dfoster at scsu.edu.